Davis Mega Maze Colossal Adventures officially opens on Saturday. My assignment today to check it out and try not to get lost. I take a picture of the maze map, then wishing I'd worn better shoes, I enter the maze, three miles of possible paths. Thankfully, I find the man who made it, farm owner Larry Davis. How big is this whole thing? Well, the maze itself is eight acres and uh, I mean several miles of mazing and you will go many you will walk many more miles than what we have carved out here because you're going to make mistakes. This is the 25th year they've planted a corn maze in the field. The theme this year witches and wizards a concept sketched out by Larry and given to a maze designer. The maze designer then has to marry that into being a world-class cornfield maze, and this, this is the only world-class cornfield maze in New England. Ranked fifth in the country by USA Today, in fact, the way through can be made more difficult if that's what you want. The second level of intensity is to come in and uh, complete the maze, but at the same time you complete it by going over every bridge. There are hidden characters to find, puzzles to solve. It is what we call a colossal cornundrum. Larry says children get through the fastest. Why? Well, we're all ears. It's kids between the age of 8 and 12 that do the best. They just, they just do it. They yeah. simply do it. They don't get caught up in being right or wrong. All right, everyone. You'll know you've made it when the David Ortiz Victory Bridge comes into view. You want to make sure that you ring the victory bell and then you are free to enjoy everything else the farm has to offer. We have all these attractions and yet I think uh, one of the biggest reasons people come here is because it is just a great fall foodie fest. It makes for a fabulous day of fun. In Sterling, Jennifer Egan, WCVB News Center 5.